all right what is good guys welcome back to the channel and today we are finally doing it we are doing the 1k sub special it's about time we're doing it q a i sent on my instagram to put questions you lot put like 13 questions and i got all the questions here i got the best ones the best questions i'm going to be answering them all honestly yeah just answering the questions honestly saying what i think giving the best answers but guys the video if you're watching this video make sure to watch till the end okay because we're trying to get the watch time up because i can get paid off this soon so watch till the end okay follow my instagram tiktok snapchat all that go follow them and let's get into it the first question we have got is this person asks what is your most viewed video all right that is a very good question what is my most viewed video because my videos i'm not gonna lie a lot of times they get good views like one my video they can get like 800 views 1k if a channel like me that's a good amount of views but yeah my most viewed video on this channel all time so far i believe if i'm not mistaken i'll put it on the screen here it is the uk youtuber reacts to f1 video and i posted that in 2021 if you see the picture of me up here my hair was diabolical i had some like that trim that i had sorry guys that trim that i had was just so like bad man that was so bad but it was a good video i'm not gonna lie it was a good reaction the f1 community liked me for that i got a lot of good comments i might react to f1 again soon when it gets to like the final race of the season oh what's it called again like the grand prix the main big race the final one i'll probably react to that again but yeah that's my most viewed video and yeah if you're wondering about maybe my most viewed short it's the cash net react to young philly song i put that one up here as well and that was a that short got crazy numbers that that short got over 1 million views right now it's on 1.4k million wait 1.4 million views and for a channel like me that is crazy man a channel with 1k subs getting a million views on the short like you don't realize how crazy that actually is man it's it's like I, listen i got a million views on the short before i hit 1k subs that is crazy man but now on to the next question is this person asks thoughts on females having male friends while in a relationship Listen, listen, let me tell you something now. Let me tell you something. If you're in a relationship, like your girl, she loves you, all this stuff, as you say, she loves you, wants to start a family with wants to start a family with you, wants to get married one day, all that nice, good, happy, jolly, merry go stuff. Listen, if that is true, why does she have male friends for? Because let me tell you something, man. When a girl has a male friend, there's only one thing the male friend wants to do, and that's to <coughs> to do that. That's the only thing he wants to do. He doesn't want to uh, be nice to her. He doesn't want to do this. He doesn't want to, oh, oh, we're just best friends. No, no, stop, stop, stop. You know deep down, if your girl has a male friend, he's not just a friend. Your girl is getting every night behind your back. And that's the fact of it, man. Because as a man, I have been there before, okay? I've been there. I've been there. Like, come on, we know for a fact and also as well, why do you need male friends? You have me, I'm your man, you get what I'm saying? But as well, listen, listen, for guys it's different. I think as guys, we can have few more friends. You know, sometimes our minds, we get in that like bad state, we just like, go through hard times, stressful days, we need like a, we need girls to talk to just to like clear our mind of stuff. But if she has male friends, it's completely wrong because she just wants to get, she just wants to get her thing like smashed so hard that's what she wants to do she wants to cheat on you she wants to chat to other guys she wants to just take the piss out of you man like if you're my girl why do you have like if you're my girl why do you have male friends for why you don't need them you got me stop it like you, you don't need me you don't need sorry guys you don't need male friends you have me that's the most important things and yeah actually you know what it depends man like it depends on the girl how she acts maybe but there should be a limit. Like if you want, if you want to have male friends, I mean, if you want if you want your girl to have male friends, fair enough. That's on you, I guess. Fair enough. Do your thing. But come on, man. Like the match you can have is like three male friends. My girl's not having like eight male friends. Are you crazy? What? Come on, man. Stop, 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 man. But the moral of the story is, don't let your girl have any male friends. And if you do, you're basically worse than Adam Twenty Two, man. Next question is, and this person sent it on the DMs. And shout out to my friend Mervin, Mervin Games, his channel. Go check it out, go sub. But yeah, he said on the messages, my thing's bugging or whatever. So I try to put something. He said, would you do my IRL content, like vlogs and stuff, or just challenges IRL? And that is a very good question, you know. Will I do more vlogs than the IRL content? Listen, that question, 
I've definitely got stuff coming up soon. I've got like lots of vlogs, IRL videos. Literally, I've got IRL videos, challenges, all that stuff. Because before in like 2023, I was doing hella challenges. I stopped them. But I'm going to bring them back. And guys, let me show you the videos I've got planned. So, first off, I've got a cooking video I'm going to probably do soon in the half term or the summer. Then I've got vlog, just like maybe if I go on holiday or go somewhere nice, I'll try and vlog it. IRL videos, like let's say I go to a football match, a basketball game, I'll vlog that. And as well, maybe not, probably not this year, but next year, I've got something planned crazy with this big YouTuber. He's coming to the UK. I'm going to be in vlogs with him, hopefully doing videos with him, going to be vlogging with him. We're going to be going around London together, just chilling. Doing hella stuff together. But I can't say who it is. But I just know it's a big YouTuber. And it will probably happen next year summer. Hopefully it should happen next year summer or this year. It depends how it goes. But I can't say his name yet. But it's a big YouTuber. Alright. And yeah. Alright. The next question we have got is. What is the best video that you've made in your opinion? Ooh, that might be the best question we've got so far. I'm not going to lie. I've made a lot of videos. I'm not going to lie. Oh my god. What is the best video I've made? Wow, that is a good question. Oh my god, ah, that's tough. You know, I'm not gonna lie. The best video I've made, actually, wait, 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 wait. The best video I've made, okay, I'll do two. I'll say what's my best reaction video I think I made, in my opinion. My best reaction video I've done so far, I would say, honestly, has to be the Playboy Carti on the moon reaction. And I'll tell you why, because we were sitting so long for Carti single. And when he finally dropped, that moment was crazy, man. We got a Carti song finally. That's my favourite reaction video. And my favourite challenge video is probably the mystery world one. Actually, no, no, no. Honestly, so overall, my favourite video is the, oh, is the is the McDonald's mystery world one. I've done the video in, I think it was 2022. Yeah, it was the mystery world one. I'll put it up here. That video was a banger, man. And my favorite reaction video I done is the Playboy Carti Your Demean reaction. I put that up here too. Dempsey videos, check them out. They're bangers. They're my favorite video. Oh my god, sorry guys. They are my two favorite videos I've done. And yeah, man. And the question we have got is this person said, Heard you were an Arsenal fan. Listen, listen, listen. This shirt, this shirt on me. I wear this for life. This shirt is for life. You hear me? This shirt is for life. It's not a trend. Nothing like that. Yesterday, we won the FA Cup and we beat Man City. While Arsenal are still on zero trophies. My star boy gets a man in the match in the FA Cup. And your star boy gets a Nando sauce. It's different to this, man. My manager wins trophies. Your manager wins the We Beat City. We push it to the limit trophy, man. Stop it. I'm not an Arsenal fan. I never, I never will be. Never support this fucking shit club, man. Dead fan base. Your club. Listen, listen. You all got second again. You got nothing. We got the FA Cup. So who really won, huh? Who really won? Who? Tell me who really won. Who really won? Who really won? This is not stop, man. I'm not an Arsenal fan. This club, I hate it with a burning passion. That is why I dropped the Arsenal short video two years in a row. Yeah, man. Your club, I just don't like your fans. I don't like nothing about your club. Your club is just so bad, man. Your players think they're better than everyone else. Saka's a fraud. Odegaard's a fraud. Wright is a fraud. Trostad is a fraud. Pai is a fraud. All your teams are fraud. All your players are frauds. Stop. I'm not an Arsenal fan. This question we have got is this person said, Thoughts on Tyree Gaming? Obviously, Tyree Gaming. I know in real life, one of my close friends, he used to do the thumbnail as well as his. He used to. He, fucking. <laughs> I speak. Yeah, Tyree Gaming. I know in real life, close. One of my close friends, he used to do my thumbnails like six months ago on the channel for the reaction videos. But yeah, he has more, he has like 300 more subs than me, I think, something like that. But Tyree Gaming, you're probably watching this. And when you are, come back to YouTube, I'm need you to post. So YouTube, come back and post the video. You haven't posted in like five months. Come back and post, okay? Come back, man. But yeah, Tyree Gaming, honestly, when, when he was posting, these videos were good. Little FX chat done his FX series thing. Good series, I rate it, man. He's got, he's got a nice community, man. He wants him to come back. Good channel, good videos, I rate him. He got 1K subs before me. Had to respect him for that. But obviously, like, obviously, we all know him. Like, come on, man. We all know overall I'm the better channel than him. I'm so clear than him. I got them, man. If you ask on the street, who's Tyree Gaming? No one's going to know. 
if you ask who's Jay Wong King, you're gonna see like 20 girls come running to me screaming, Jay Wong King, Jay Wong King. Come on, they're not, not, not so it's Harry Gamer, they're not doing that. But for me, they are, you get what I'm saying? Like, I have aura, he don't, he fell off. Like, Harry Gaming fell off, I'm up now. Okay, this guy fell off so hard, he's got no aura, his aura's in the minus. But yeah, man, YouTube. Come back to YouTube, man. We need you back. Come back. Just, just, just more of the story is just come back to YouTube. The question we have got is how long did it take you to get 1k subs? All right, that is a good question. So my first video was in September 2021. The little easy video. So September 22, 23. So two years and a bit it took me to hit 1k subs. But before YouTube in 2021, 2022. I wasn't that consistent, you get what I'm trying to say? I was posting like once a week, really, three times a week. But then 2023 was my most consistent era so far. I was posting basically every day, but I did take like a six month break and I'll never do that again. But yeah, it took me two years and a bit to hit 1k subs. People say, oh, it took you so long to hit 1k subs. I don't care, man. Let me tell you something. Kai Sinat in an interview said slow growth is better than no growth and that is facts man it's better to go at your own pace and watch everyone else it could take you 10 years to hit a million subs it don't matter once you hit it you hit it man not everyone's gonna be like i show speed hitting hitting insane numbers every week every month it don't work like that people got their own pace in this youtube stuff and yeah the next question and guys i have to change the background because over there the lighting it was a bit bad because obviously it's night time now for me i have to because i was busy during the day i had to stop recording for a bit by the green scene, the lighting got a bit bad. But yeah, we have got top five girls I would do it with. This is a very good question, probably one of the best questions. And the answer to this, I won't do no order. I'll just say the five girls. And when I'm saying them, I'll put a pick of them on the screen here. And there's someone on the screen, I'll put a pick of them. And the first girl we have is, if you know me, if you know this channel, ever since I reacted to Bikini Bottom in 2022, the reactions of her, Bikini Bottom, Princess Diana, no, I'm trying to say, just her music videos, her songs, her presence, she's got that, oh, what's the word I'm looking for, what's, what's the word again, yeah, she's got that aura, she's just got that aura about her, she's just a special girl, and this girl I'm talking about here, it's Ice Spice, this girl is one of one, nice body, nice hair, everything, man, she, like, she's special, I don't think we'll ever see another female artist like Ice Spice again, when that album drops Y2K, I'll definitely react to that. But Ice Spice is one of my favourite girls. One of my favourite female artists, definitely. And yeah, shout out to Ice Spice. Hopefully, hopefully you see one of my reactions one day. And if you do, that would be crazy, man. But the next girl we have got is she is from London, the UK. I think, in my opinion, the one of the best girls in London, if not the best. We have got, it's 8 o'clock in the morning. Now I'm entering my bed. We have got Pink Pantheris. Oh my God, Pink Pantheris. This girl is one of them girls, when you go to war against Russia, go to war against Palestine, all these countries, you're shooting up man like it's Black Ops 3, you keep a pick of her in your locker. She's one of them girls like, oh, this girl is special. Oh, she's one of them girls you go on your knees for, you give her the diamond ring. Like, she's wife, I'm not like, like, I spy, she's good, but she ain't wife material, again, I'm trying to say, like, Pink Pampers, that's a girl who's wife material. Oh, yeah, Pink Pampers. She makes nice songs. She's got a nice voice. Yeah, man. Yeah. She's just like, oh, she's just good in it. Like, there's nothing really wrong about her. Nothing bad about her. She's got a nice smile. She's got that nice presence to her. She's just there in it. So the next girl we have got is number three. We have got a female rapper. She beefs us. She beefs us. Oh my God! Let me speak. She has beef. With Ice Spice, but that don't matter. It don't matter, okay? Because we have got this girl right here. I've known her since like 2020, 2021, kind of post lockdown, I would say. And we've got Lao. This girl right here, light skin like Ice Spice, thick as well, nice hair, nice body. Just overall, a very good looking woman, a very beautiful woman. Lao, shout out to you, man. You make. I wouldn't really say you make hits, so you're not really like you know, your music. It's not an ice spice level, but yeah, you're still you're still a good looking girl. So shout out, to, not good looking. You're still an amazing girl. So shout out to you. And the fourth girl we have got is we have got Lil Uzi Vert's girlfriend from. What's her name again? I'm bugging guys. Sorry. Yeah, Lil Uzi Vert's girlfriend from the City Girls. We have got JT, like JT, this girl, dark skin. 
fine, thick as well. She's got that, like, she's got, like, the curve. You know what I'm trying to say? She's got that round. She's got the cakes on her. She's thick. She's got clear skin. Because for me, guys, on the girl, the most important thing, I think, is a girl to have clear skin and nice hair. Because if your skin is all sporty, all rashy, all that stuff, why are you going out like that? Stop. Go put some cream on your face. Go put some lotion. Go put on some makeup on and you can step aside and talk to people, okay? But yeah, JT, nice girl, nice hair. And I played one of our songs the other day. Uh, is this bitch okay? She, she's mm, fucking around. Is this bitch okay? Yeah, that song is a hit, man. JT, what's the, what's the other song called again? Ah. Oh. How so funny got me looking at them sideways. I think that's how it goes. And then, ah, oh, what's the other one again? Oh, fuck. No, no bars, no bars. Bitch, I ain't friendly. I'm oh, fucking your son. Like, yeah, but well, that song's a hit, man. JT, her songs are hits. Good singles. Shout out to JT. And the last girl we have got is. Oh my god, this girl is a 10 out of 10, 99 overall badges. She is basically like post World Cup Rashford, 07 Ronaldo. Oh man, prime Pogba. This girl, let me tell you something right now. This girl is special. She is one of one. And this girl I'm talking about is, is the one, the only Ruby Rose. <sighs> Ruby, man. Ruby, Ruby. Oh my days. And I know. She's dated the whole wireless wireless set, the whole Ronnie Loud set. She's dated Kai, Uzi, Future, all the rappers that I'm trying to say. I think I'll put it on the screen there if I can find it. I'll put a graph of all the people she has dated. But it don't matter, man. Ruby Rose, this girl, like, she's thick, but she's slim thick. She's got a nice skin, nice hair. Ruby, if you're saying this, please, Ruby, man, please. I'm not, a Ruby, listen, right now, I'm not 18. When I'm 18, please, next year, next year, February, please, Ruby, please. I'm begging, please, just please, man, I need it, please, man. Oh, listen, when I get money, Ruby Rose, I'm coming to you, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, I'm at, I'm at the end of the video and have a little, you know what I mean, have a little cheeky one to her right now. Oh, I'm joking, I'm joking, guys, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking, don't shoot me, I'm joking, I'm joking, but yeah, Ruby Rose, she's a very nice girl, nice looking woman, shout out to her.